Hi everyone, Josh Hendy here. What you're watching right now is my 4X CNC machine. It has two Cartesian axes and two rotary axes. It was made specifically to cut this. R2D2's head. Ever since I first saw Star Wars as a kid, I dreamed of having my own fully functioning R2D2 robot. My R2 droid will be able to transition from two leg to three leg mode and have a variety of actuators on many of the panels around the droid to bring it to life. I'll also be fitting this droid with a Raspberry Pi, a camera, a microphone, and a whole bunch of sensors so that I can write some code to give it artificial intelligence. Getting back to the 4X CNC, I'll be using it to machine a mold in the shape of R2's head. That mold will then be placed in a vacuum former and used to create a plastic dome. Then it's back to the 4X CNC where the plastic dome will have all the various panels, holes, and details of R2's head machined. My R2-D2 that I'll be building will be half scale because I've got limited space at the moment. However, I made sure that my 4X CNC machine can accommodate a full size R2-D2 dome, so in the future I could use it to build a full scale version. Here's a demo showing the toolpaths generated by my custom software to machine R2-D2's dome. The software for generating the G-code is very much a work in progress and still needs to take into account the diameter of the end mill, tabs for the profile cuts, and making sure it doesn't do any rapids through the workpiece. I've got a few other projects cooking in the background. Firstly, a spherical hexapod robot, heavily inspired by the Morphex created by Zenta link in the description to his website. Secondly, a Game Boy Pi, an original Game Boy powered by a Raspberry Pi Zero, and lastly, a BB-8 robot to go along with R2. So this was just a quick update. I'll be making more videos detailing these projects, so stay tuned. In the meantime, you can check out my blog at joshhendyblog.net for updates and more info on my projects. Link in the description. Thanks for watching.